everybody. Welcome to another Megan Monday. I'd like to apologize for you guys having to see me like this. My face is looking pretty rough because I don't have anything on it because we're about to do the no mirror makeup challenge. Also, I just woke up from a nap not that long ago and uh, that's why my face looks super tired. Anyways, for those of us that wear makeup, we know how vital a mirror is. If we don't use a mirror, how do we know what we look like? I saw Jenna Marbles make this video, I think she did it like a long time ago. So I'm pretty behind on this challenge, but I just really wanted to try it because it seemed like fun. And also, I don't even think I'm very good at makeup when I do have a mirror, so this could be interesting. Let's get started. I usually start with mixing this foundation by Urban Decay with a little bit of this foundation by Pure because this one's really thick and the other one's really thin. I feel like if I mix them together, you get some good uh, some good medium thickness level in here. Here we go. I just feel so wrong not looking at anything. Like a mirror or my, like I can't, I just feel so wrong not looking at myself. So, just dab this stuff on here and hopefully it's looking okay. Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> and then like, I usually put it down here and stuff too. Cause I always like, I fake tan with like lotion and stuff, so my face doesn't always match my body. I, I feel like I did a lot of blending here. Next, I usually add some under eye concealer. I have like extreme dark circles under my eyes I feel like because of getting hit in the face with a softball, so I like to like load this stuff up and hope that it's making it look less nasty. I don't know what it's looking like. I just recently bought this contouring kit because I wanted to start like contouring like everyone else has been doing for years because I feel like it really helps your face out and stuff. Let's just see what happens here. I think right here is good. Huh? And then this action. I'm afraid it's gonna look like super dark or something. Eh? And here? Eh? And you gotta blend it out. Just blend it out. And then, you wanna do some like down here if you're like me and you don't have like a really sweet jaw and it like sticks out, you add some of this and then give you some definition. Oh and then also they have this like banana-y color in here. So sometimes I've been putting it under my eyes now because it's supposed to make it also less like dark circles. Yeah. Okay, I often fill in my eyebrows and I feel like this is gonna be a real challenge here. This is where my eyebrow is. Oh my gosh, I don't know. I feel so helpless right now. Is that, is that better, worse? Let's just rub this out. Oh my gosh, I'm like, I'm like afraid for how I'm gonna look after this. Hope that looks okay. <laughs> Why don't we just add some blush? I don't normally wear blush, but it's right here, so let's just pop some of it on, shall we? Right then, I usually put on some eyeshadow. We should go for a bold look, because why not? I'm gonna pop this color on Roach by Urban Decay. I always use my finger, because I'm not fancy and don't know which brush you're supposed to use. Okay, this part I feel like is gonna be a real challenge. This Benefit push-up liner is like the most intense gel eyeliner, and once you get it on, it like pretty much doesn't come off at all. So let's try it. I can't even do like good cat eyes when I am looking in the mirror, so how am I gonna get them even now? Here we go. I'm going for it. I'm just I'm just gonna go for it. Right here. Does that seem right? Oh gosh. <laughs> you guys should try this. For any guys watching this that don't wear makeup, now you see what a struggle it is. I feel like things are are taking a real turn for the worse here. Let's try this. Curl my tiny little, oh, baby lashes. Pop some Dior mascara on here. Oh yeah. I feel like this is right, at least. Gotta get those bottom lashes. I want this dramatic, dramatic, dramatic look. Okay, I'm not seeing my normal eyeliner. I usually use like a, a grayish color on my bottom lids, but I'm not seeing it, so we're gonna, gonna use this brown one. Oh, 
Jangan terlalu gelap. Okay, I almost never wear anything on my lips except like chapstick maybe. But because we're going, oh, this is like melted or something. Because we're going bold, we're just gonna put this on and and see how it looks. Okay. Yeah. Uh, oh, melted and weird. Okay. I feel like that's it. Do I look amazing? Give you guys a close up view here. Do I look phenomenal? Like better than I've ever looked before? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you learned a lot of makeup tips here. And uh, I wanna go see what I look like. Probably really great and I should probably go out right now. I'm a crazy blurtier. <laughs> okay, well I love you guys and I hope you liked this and I hope that you like it. And I hope that you subscribe and tell me what else you wanna see and I'll make it for you. Cause I am here to please you guys to a certain extent. Let's not get weird. Okay, love you, bye. You made it through my whole video? That's amazing. You guys are champions. You're probably already subscribed. But if you're not, don't forget to subscribe. Give it a thumbs up because it's really hard to pee when you're wearing a onesie. And don't forget to watch my other videos. I got some good stuff in here, I promise. I love you. Okay, okay, bye.